Hi guys, so I'm filming the intro after the video, but in today's video I'm going to be going to a few shops and having a look around at the new in Barbie stuff. I also made a very exciting purchase in this video for Ryan's family, so I hope you enjoy it watching. If you do, please leave a thumbs up. Make sure to subscribe to my channel for more videos just like this and for role plays. And without further ado, let's get into it. Went to B and M bargains, and as you can see, I found this Barbie extra set for sixty five pounds, which is amazing because normally these dolls are around thirty pounds each, I believe. I only have one, and that's the doll I use for Madison, but she was thrifted. But I know brand new; they can be expensive. So for sixty five for all of them's actually a bargain. I found quite a few of the Tiffany Worlds dolls, which are basically a dupe of Barbie. And I also found the Barbie Extra Vanity, which looks like it's been reduced as well. They had this birthday set and this snowboarding set. And now there's the new Barbie Ambulance. This is the new Barbie Ambulance and it was £35, which is actually good because it's a two-in-one play set. And there's a few new play sets that I've not seen before, like this teacher and this dentist one. Moving on, I went to a charity shop and this is where I find a lot of my Barbie things because you can just get so many amazing deals and I definitely did get one. And here are just some of the mini verses. I've not really had many of them. I've only tried one and some squish fills because these are what I use in my role plays for decoration. I found the old rainbow high house that I used to have, but I donated because it took up too much space. And I was looking at doll's houses because, spoiler, I've got another doll house now. Let me see if you can guess which one it is. Obviously, you'll see it in the hall anyway. And I found the dream boat. And I always look at this, but I never end up getting it because I don't think I'd get the use out of it. And they had the new dream camper, the ambulance again, and just a few dream Topio inspired items as well, which I'm not really that interested in. And this Stacey doll. I like her outfit, but I didn't get her because I already have a lot of Stacey dolls. And then here are just some of the fashionistas, which they were really low on. Right, guys. So I'm going to do the haul now. And as you can see, I did actually pick up the Malibu house, which I showed in the vlog. And this is going to be Ryan's new house because, as you guys know, him and Amelia and Josh are moving. And this is going to be the house they're going to move into. I haven't decided yet if I'm going to customise it or anything. Let me know what you think I should do on my Instagram. But I'm very excited to unbox this and get using it with Ryan's family. Because at the moment I have been sharing my dream house with Ryan and Jess's family. And originally I thought that was a good idea because it saved a lot of space not having two houses. But... It just makes the houses look the same obviously and it doesn't really work for videos so that's why i've got this house obviously it is a lot smaller than the dream house but i just won't have all of their rooms set up and what i like about this is it folds down so that it can be stored away easily which is the reason i went for this house over the other houses so that's this then from smith's as well i picked up this new babysitter's ink doll so obviously she is a skipper, but the main reason that I thought I'd get this is because I thought she would be good for Amelia's next stage because she kind of looks like a Stacey, even though she's a skipper size. So that was why I thought I'd pick up this set. And also the accessories that this comes with are super cute and the baby that it comes with is really adorable. And it's a water toy as well, so the baby's face will change when you add water to it. So it's really cute. I have got something similar to this already but not this exact play set. And on the back, you can see that in more detail. So if you add hot water, I believe the, the food goes away. And if you add cold water, then food comes back. And it looks like the baby's been eating, which is really cute. And this big bundle here is everything that I got from the charity shop. So this was £3 for everything in this bag, which I think is really good because as you can see, there's a lot in here to get through. I think it's a mix of Barbie, Bratz, and just princess doll stuff but let's just go through it item by item we've got this pair of ladies jeans a ken top obviously i'll wash all of this as well guys before i put it on my dolls but i just thought i'd show you this is really cute i think that will fit amy as well it's like a little knitted cardigan this brat's chloe top 
this little Bratz top, this Bratz night top, a little Barbie top, this little jacket. These are some kind of Bratz sportswear, I believe. I'm not sure which Bratz doll they are for, though. A Ken top. This shower curtain thing. This Bratz jade coat. A pair of purple trousers. A Bratz leather jacket. This is quite detailed. This flamingo blanket or towel. Some kind of skirt. I'm not sure if this is a Bratz one. A lot of this stuff is Bratz. This top, that would definitely fit Amy. But I like Bratz clothes because they fit Amy. And any Chelsea doll. This dress, which might be a Monster High one not sure this dress which apparently was supposed to be three pounds on its own but it was in this bundle so it must be a barbie one if they're charging three pounds for one outfit this brat's dress but it looks like it's frayed really bad so i'll probably have to throw that away this little top i think this is a hat it's all stuck together um, that's just a piece of fabric. But yeah, this is actually a hat. I don't have any material doll hats, but maybe I could use that for Jess's mum if there's ever a wedding. This little Bratz t-shirt, but it looks like the pattern's come off, so that may need to be thrown away. A random bit of fabric. This, which I really like, this is a smart... Ken shirt with a tie and a waistcoat. This would be so good for weddings or even just for smart dress. The same with this Barbie doctor's uniform. This would be really handy for upcoming videos, especially with Jess's pregnancy. There is this little skirt. A Barbie suitcase. And we have this skirt. I'm not sure if this is from a Frozen doll because I think this is definitely from a Frozen doll. This dress, which is actually one of my favourite things in this bundle as well, because it's so nice. Look at the pattern. Super summery or for spring even. And I'll definitely get a lot of wear out of that in summer and spring videos. That's a fashionista dress. Another one of those frozen Disney skirts. This little denim jacket. How adorable is that? another dress I'm not sure if this is a frozen dress i really don't know a lot about disney dolls so do excuse that this floral barbie dress this barbie dress with a leaf design on it this little chelsea dress this is from the bride's bride and groom set that i've seen in smiths a lot of times i believe it's so cute though i think this would even fit alice this pair of leggings these will be good for Jess while she's pregnant this Bratz top this interesting patterned top another shirt I've definitely got more clothes now for the guys which is good because I'm always looking for men's clothes these shorts this denim style jacket but it's not real denim it's just material a nice pair of black trousers this which i think is a skirt i'm not sure if it's homemade or what it's from but I've got that this rainbow skirt a plastic cowboy hat this, which I believe is Moana's skirt. Another suitcase. I 
filled with shoes. I'm not sure if they're all pairs or anything. They look like they are, which is amazing because I'm always looking for doll shoes. And the last thing in this bundle is this backpack. So that's everything from the charity shop. And for three pounds, there's a lot there. So that's amazing. And that's everything. So I hope you have enjoyed this haul. It, I know it was a, just a quick video, but I just thought that some of you might enjoy seeing what is currently in shops and what I've managed to find from secondhand shops. If you did, please leave a thumbs up, subscribe for more videos. And until next time, I will see you guys soon. Bye.